2017 feels like a lifetime ago, but one of the truly great shows that year was in it of itself. Derek Delgadio boggled the minds of audiences in New York City, using the power of illusion to tell just an incredible story about identity. And it began every single night with each audience member choosing a card to identify themselves. And now his show, In and of Itself, is coming to Hulu. Broadway.com correspondent Charlie Cooper talked to the creator and star. Derek Delgadio's acclaimed off-Broadway show, In and of Itself, is available on Hulu. The captivating story of his personal journey becomes a collective experience, even from the comfort of your own home. I spoke with Derek about preserving the one-of-a-kind show. So you guys made a decision to preserve this show for Hulu. Talk about the importance of doing that and why you guys even decided to do that. I haven't made it a habit to um, film my work or record it. I just uh, it didn't think it translated uh, or wasn't intended to be translated to a different medium. But this this show was different. I felt like I, 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 at some point after doing it enough in New York, I, I saw something happening. Uh, in the room that I, I that no one else was privileged to see because I had a very unique perspective in, in that performance where I, I got to stare at them every single night and um, and so I got to see their faces and the work was having an effect the work was resonating and the the things I was trying to say it was being heard as we watch the show it kind of unravels like it almost feels like an onion like you're peeling back the layers and eventually towards the end I just was able to see how connected the entire room of people were, um, and I imagine so many of them were probably strangers. Was that intentional? The secret is that the um, of the show is that it was never really about me. It's about them. They just didn't know it. They think that this is an autobiographical show about me, and they slowly it starts to dawn on them that there's something else bubbling under the surface here. And by the end of it, it becomes clear that that I. I'm just a proxy for their experience or their entryway into this idea about identity, which is actually really about them, which is to say it's about all of us. And so it's my job uh, to let the artifice sort of fall away as, as the experience progresses so that you're left seeing the truth. I know right now, especially with everybody stuck at home, being on a streaming platform, how much does this Hulu opportunity mean to you? This is a very untraditional project. Uh, I don't think there's anything really like it. Everyone who's come to the project has come based on their, a, a kind of a belief system of just believing in that the work matters and that it should be seen. I really look forward to having it on a platform where, where you know, more people will see it arguably in the first week than did in the entire run, which is really incredible.